With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question is using method of integration, find the area in square units of the smaller portion enclosed between the curves x square plus y square equal to 4 and y square equal to 3x. Okay. So basically there are two curves. Okay. So we will draw it roughly over here. So first curve is a circle of radius 2. Okay. So this is our first curve of uh, radius 2 which is 2 comma 0 and the second curve which is a parabola but the, this parabola is symmetric in x axis. Okay. So this is the parabola and we need to find the area enclosed between these two curves which is this. Okay. We need to find this area. So how we will do this? First of all we need to find the intersection points between this curves okay so how to find this intersection points this we will square this okay squaring this we will get as y raised to 4 upon 9 equal to x square okay and we will substitute this x square in this equa equation okay so x square plus y square which is equal to 4 so substituting x square as y raised to 4 by 9 plus y square which is equal to 4 let us multiply this whole equation by 9 we will get this as y raised to 4 plus 9y square minus 36 equal to 0. So you can see that this is a biquadratic. Okay. So how to solve a biquadratic? We can do a substitution over here. We can assume that y square is equal to m. So the equation will be m square plus 9m minus 36. And the roots of this equation are m plus 12 into m minus 3. Okay. So you can easily calculate the root roots of this quadratic equation so we get m is equal to minus 12 and m is equal to 3 but what is m m is equal to y square okay any any square cannot be negative okay it can't be negative so it must be a positive number so y square is equal to 3 y square can't be equal to 12 hence we are rejecting this value so y square is equal to 3 then what is y so y will be equal to root 3 or y equal to minus root, root 3 okay. So these are two possible values for y okay. So we got the intersection point for y. This is root 3, this is positive root 3 and this is negative root 3 okay. We will integrate this function with respect to y axis because we need this area right. We need this area. And this area of circle minus the area of parabola, which is this area. Okay. After subtracting the area of circle minus area covered by parabola, we will get our required area. So how to do that? We need to integrate those area first. Okay. So first of all, we will write the equation of circle, which is x square plus y square equal to 4. And the parabola equation is y square equal to 3x. Okay. So now we will take the integration of this circle from parabola okay so what is the value of y we are getting so what is the value of x we are getting from here x is equal to 4 minus y square under root okay and the value of x we are getting from here is x is equal to y so we need to integrate under root of 4 minus y square dx minus y square by 3 dy sorry it is dy we need to integrate 4 under, under root 4 minus y square dy minus y square by 3 dy okay plus root 3 okay why minus root 3 to plus root 3 because in the diagram only you can see that these are the intersection okay and we need to calculate the area between these two values okay so now let us this form so you know the formula of integration of a square minus x square dx what is the formula of this expression which is x by 2 under root of a square minus x square plus a square by 2 sine inverse of x by a okay this is the formula of this integration just remember it so now we will integrate this term okay so according to the formula we get limits from minus root 3 to 
plus root 3 okay we get the following as so replace this x by y because we are integrating in terms of y okay so y by 2 under root of what is a square here yes it is 4 minus y square plus a square is 4 by 2 into sine inverse of y by 2 because a is 2 okay minus integration of y square by 3 would be y cube by 9 so now let us put the limits okay so first of all we will put upper limit okay putting upper limit minus lower limit this is root 3 okay so now just putting upper limit minus lower limit it would be root 3 by 2 under root of 4 minus 3 plus 2 into sine inverse of root 3 by 2 minus what is cube of root 3 it is 3 root 3 by 9 okay we have put upper limit upper limit minus lower limit yes so lower limit is minus root 3 by 2 under root of 4 minus 3 plus 2 sin inverse of root 3 by 2 minus 3 root 3 by 9 okay so this is minus okay this is minus of root 3 by 2 as we are putting lower limit okay which is minus root 3 and this is also minus minus plus it will become plus so further we need to calculate this part so what it would be 3 root under root 3 by 2 into 1 plus under root 3 by 2 into 1 okay so what it would be it will be root 3 okay root 3 we have added this now now the second term is 2 sin inverse of root 3 by 2 minus of 2 sin inverse of minus root 3 by 2 what is sin inverse of minus x it is minus sin inverse of x okay x yes so we can write we can take this minus over here so it will be minus 2 of root 3 by 2 so minus 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 will become plus and we will add these both terms which is 4 sin inverse of root 3 by 2 so writing here which is plus 4 sin inverse of root 3 by 2 okay so now this minus root 3 root 3 by 9 minus 3 root 3 by 9 so it will get add which is which would be minus 6 root 3 by 9 okay simplify this answer by simplifying this answer we will get root 3 plus 4 and what is sine inverse of root 3 it is pi by 3 minus 6 root 3 by 9 so root 3 plus 4 pi by 3 minus we will divide this by 3 so this is 2 and this is 3 and after dividing it also by root 3 we will get this as like this so this will be 2 by root 3 so the final answer we are getting is root 3 plus 4 by, by 3 minus 2 by root 3 this is the area bounded by this two curves okay this this is the required area okay which is root 3 root 3 plus 4 pi by 3 minus 2 by root 3 okay thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today